Hey everyone, this is Steve from Publish Press. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use multiple authors to display lots of authors for one single WordPress post. By default, WordPress only allows you one author for each post. In other videos posted here on YouTube, I've gone through the actual setup process for Publish Press authors. In this video, we're going to focus on how to actually display them on the front end of your site. So, in order to follow along, you will need Publish Press authors installed on your site and you will need some default authors set up as well. So, I'm going to go to the post screen and at the moment, all of my posts only have one author. So, I'm going to edit one of these posts and then down on the right hand side, in the authors area, I'm going to add a couple more authors. I will click on update and then I will view the post on the front end of the site. Now you should see in the authors area below the post, there are three different authors added for this single post. This is the default and the easiest way to add multiple authors using the Publish Press Authors plugin. If you decide that you don't want this author box appearing underneath the content, the way to configure this is by going to your WordPress dashboard, going to Authors and Settings, and under the Display tab, you can uncheck this box, Show Below the Content, and that will remove that author's box from appearing automatically. There's one other thing to note about this setup as well, and that is that the default text underneath the title may not always show all of your authors. This is because the Publish Press Authors plugin had to do quite a big workaround to avoid the default WordPress authors system and make it possible to add all these authors. And so this default setup may have to be disabled. The best way to do it is normally by relying on your theme and most themes, most good modern themes have an option to disable this one fairly easily. I'm using a theme called Astra in this example and if I go to blog and single post, I can click on this visible eye icon and it's as simple as that to hide the default author option here. With one or two themes, if they don't have an option like this, it may be a little bit more complicated. You may need to add a little bit of CSS perhaps to hide this, but if you contact Publish Press Support, we can help you. So, we've seen the default option, and this is to show an author's box underneath each post. However, Publish Press Authors has other options for you as well. One of them is a widget, which allows you to show the authors in the sidebar. In this example, we have two widgets that have come from Publish Press Authors. Authors list is going to show a list of all your authors, not necessarily for one post, but for all your posts, and also post author. I'm going to drag and drop this up here into the sidebar, and if I go to check on my post with multiple authors, I'll see that it's now available as a widget. If I browse around the site by visiting other posts, you'll notice that the widget will automatically update to reflect the single author or multiple authors of that particular post. In this case, it's Nicolette. In this case, it's Ryan. And if I go back to a post with more than one author, you'll see all of them listed here. Let me contrast that quickly with the other widget that I mentioned earlier. This is the authors list widget, and it will show all of the authors. And if you want to, you can even show them if they haven't actually written any content yet. So visibly, the difference between these is that this will show the authors of the post we're looking at, and this widget will show all the authors on your site. A third option that's available is to use a shortcode 
to show the authors. On the published press site, we have some documentation on how to use these shortcodes. The simplest use case is author underscore box. And all you need to do is edit a post on your site. And I'm going to use a Gutenberg block in this example. I will put my shortcode in there, click update, and when I visit the front of the site, I'm going to see the authors displayed in there. So this is an extra way to get more flexibility when it comes to displaying your authors. The documentation on the published press site has information about other layout options that you can use to expand the shortcode or the widget or even the author's box underneath the content. There are at least five different layout options, a simple list, a centered layout, a boxed layout, an inline layout, and an inline layout with avatars. And these are available for the box under your posts, for your widgets, and also for your shortcodes. If we go back to take a look at these different options, you'll see that you can choose from these layout options in the settings area. So if you go to authors, settings, and display, you can choose for these different options underneath your post. For example, I could choose a very simple inline option. If I go to appearance and widgets, and inside the widget, I can choose another layout option in line with avatar. And also, if I edit the shortcode, I can add a little bit of extra text, and I'm going to use the documentation here. I can add a little bit of extra text to customize the shortcode. So now let me visit the front of the site and you'll see all sorts of different layouts. This is the big boxed layout that I've just used. This is the very simple straightforward inline layout. And this up here is the inline layout with avatars. Hopefully this gives you a good introduction to the options available to display your authors in Publish Press Authors. If you head over to the Publish Press website, you can get a pro version of Publish Press Authors, which allows you to create your own custom layouts and also add fields to include more data about your authors.